And so I got wrapped up in this. I had no idea what they were. Um, uh, uh, a peer that I sold weed to all through high school, she approached me and said, hey, um, you know, my mom is got this thing going on and she needs some help uh, with somebody to, she doesn't want to use her insurance and she needs some help with getting these things, getting the pills. And so I basically, without knowing what they were, I looked at how much could be made and it was like jaw dropping. And so I said, okay, I'm in. And so I started and basically I was taking people. Um, it started with one and it turned into multiple, but taking people, what was called doctor shopping and okay. taking them to the, yeah. And, and it was just this ring of, of getting these things and selling them. And eventually I started using them and I became just heavily addicted. Um, I mean, these things ran my life. My, 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 my life was ran around two things every day, woke up. It was, this, it was, it was by getting high and my phone ringing. Like those were the two things that just ran my life. And it was this vicious, vicious cycle of addiction and greed and in one head, you know, one hand washed the other. Um, and basically it all came crashing down 2000 and uh, late 2012. And I was arrested in what was labeled as a drug deal gone bad. Uh, it was a robbery uh, against another fellow, another drug dealer. And, um, and yeah, I was facing a life in prison for this charge. Uh, it was armed robbery. And so here I am, 22 years old, facing life in prison. 